y'all you're in for a treat i just got a call that we are about to do a surprise proposal today in a few hours so i'm like in the bathroom about to hurry up finish getting ready and head out the door because it is now about 4 20 and i still need to go up into the attic get some vases which I'm really, really nervous. I don't do addicts. I have to be brave. I have to go get this stuff myself because I need to make it out the house and beat Nashville's traffic so we can get this proposal going. And I'll, I'll explain more in the car, but I gotta go. Oh, I am in the car. I am on my way to a location that I think will be fine. I wanna scout it out real fast to make sure that it's good. Original plans are changing because our soon-to-be groom cannot wait another day. He wants to be engaged. He wants his girl to have a ring on it, which I don't blame you. So um, we are making it work, and it is going to be good. So I am taking you along for a for real, for real surprise proposal. <laughs> like this is a surprise to, to everyone on this day. So it is definitely going to be fun. It's the excitement that's already happening for me like I'm like oh I'm getting anxious I'm ready I'm so like ready to see how it's gonna play out oh I need to go get the rose petals I'm gonna have to do that myself because the place where I get um, Nashville flower market it's hidden so it's just easier for me to go than try to explain to someone where it's at in a short time so I can do that I'm actually call them and get it all paid for and get it going but the only thing about it is is that it is rush hour right now so i was having a lazy day y'all i finished with some of my work and i was just having a lazy day watching Grey's anatomy over because i realized i've watched Grey's anatomy but i haven't re-watched episodes besides like the airplane the bombing you know, you, you know, if you're a Grey's Anatomy fan, you know, like the, like those. But as far as like rewatch, I haven't done that. So I've been enjoying doing that. Just got the petals. The flower market, that's where I go to get the flowers for everything. Now off to the location. Let's get there, let's get there. I just want to get it right, yeah. I made it to the location and so this is the Percy Priest Lake and I'm thinking I'm trying to think of a best a good way to set up if I set up kind of like in front of me so if I set up in front of me that way if it gets darker we can shine the car lights here or I can hit this little area right in here Okay, let me think, let me think. I found the spot that has like a street light, if that's what you call it. Um, and then I'm just gonna set up a little bit above it. So therefore, if it does get super dark before she gets here, it can still have like some light. So I'm gonna set up right in here, like do a heart. And then she'll still have like the water in the background. And then also we're not taking up the whole space. Cause over here is like big and I feel like more people will come this way as like, they do their walks and come out. Never thought that I would be a girl. Ooh, yeah, yeah. You're the one I'm thinking of. Come on and take my love. Let's go and we can fly away. We're taking off to the sky. It's you and me tonight. Ooh, baby. You know there was something special.
So no idea? I mean, I had like, not for real at all today, no, no. Uh -huh. so I had like in my mind that he was planning to someday soon, but not today. Emily, but. how's it feel? Wonderful. Wonderful. Y'all ready? Like yes, 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 yes. I got a son. You know, and what's so crazy is <laughs> y'all, let me tell you. I don't know why, but I've been looking at wedding dresses like crazy. You're like, what? Oh, I said, I don't know. I need to get Marcus to my deal. Look, y'all need to get Marcus to my deal. Another successful proposal. And just like that, it's a wrap. back home just gonna get organized cleaned up a little bit get these faces going so I can put them away tomorrow but what a success like that was so much fun I love the rush of that one that was <laughs> that was one thrilling ride um, let me tell you um, Tay is very early on this proposal. <laughs> so no one was expecting it at all to be today, which is which is fun. I mean, it's definitely a nice surprise and it definitely like catches you off guard. And when someone say they are ready to be engaged, they are ready to be engaged. He can't wait any longer. No more weeks, no more months. It's gonna happen today. And something else that's really special is that her birthday is actually tomorrow. That's how eager that he was, which I think that's even more special because on her birthday, she's gonna wake up and be like, ah, I'm engaged. So, very successful. Um, like I said, it was it was a lot of fun and I am so thankful for, for them to think of me um, and gave me something to do for this evening and I loved every minute of it. And now I know that I can make a proposal happen in 45 minutes, if that, <laughs> if that. But I love it, so much fun. And her mom was there, her mom was there, her sisters, and it was just so special. I cannot believe that she is engaged. So another little background, Gabby, she and her friends, there's a group of four, and all four of them are engaged right now, which is great for me, great for y'all, because you get to see tons of content. Um, but for the girls, I don't know. I think it's really exciting. Um, my sister is part of the little pack too. Um, so. I know she's she's a twin, so she doesn't like sharing things, but they they might have to share their year. So it's gonna be interesting to see how that plays out. Um, I don't think anyone is gonna get married in 2021, so 2022, hopefully someone can sneak in a 2023, because that will be, I mean, it's gonna be a lot of work, but I mean, that's okay for me, but I'm just thinking about for the girls, because that's gonna be, four weddings, but one of the weddings is gonna be theirs, and then they're gonna be in three weddings in that one year. And I don't think that they're sharing bachelorette parties. Like, my sister's not going going for that. So, <laughs> so it's gonna be one expensive, expensive year. But, hey, it's gonna be fun, and you'll definitely get to see some bridal showers planned. We're definitely going on at least one bachelorette trip, at least making one, if not two of them. If not all of them, we might just make all of them. I don't know, <laughs> we'll see. So that'll be fun content as well. And do some bridal showers and go dress shopping. So it's gonna be lots of wedding content just by those four girls just being in my life. 
and then not to mention like other clients that I have as well. So, ah, love, love is in the air. You're ever thinking about proposing to someone and you just like, oh, I need to make it happen today. You don't know what to do. You need a team together. You need help. I'm your team. I'm your girl. <laughs> you should contact me because I can do it and make it happen for you. If event content is your thing or if you just want to be nosy and come behind the scenes, I am all here for you to join the team. Subscribe to this channel. We have tons of things coming your way. We have events, lifestyle, travel, all here on this channel. So I appreciate it if you would like to subscribe. Thank you so much for coming along. I'll see you around. Bye.